Now, President William Ruto has officially launched the DAO Central Security Depository Digital Platform that allows investors to transact electronically at the Central Bank of Kenya headquarters in Nairobi. The DAO CSD platform, which has been in the works for three years, will allow investors to open bond trading accounts at the CBK online from where they will be placing their bids for their preferred securities during auctions. Our very own Gloria Mosimbi begins our bulletin with the following story. And by presenting this memorabilia to your excellency, we hope... President William Ruto has unveiled the DAO CSD digital platform that will enable Kenyans to purchase treasury bills and bonds digitally. By retiring manual processes and providing digital platforms, the DAO allows investors to transact electronically at any time from anywhere in a matter of a few minutes. According to President William Ruto, the platform will not only bring transparency to the acquisition of treasury paper, but opens the door for Kenyans to participate in the market. The CST investors portal and mobile application have also delivered inclusion by opening up access to the securities market to everyone, regardless of their status, including many of whom the requirement of physical travel and manual transactions presented significant barriers. President Ruto say that the electronic infrastructure will deepen the domestic capital market, promote savings and investments besides fostering the growth and stability of financial markets. That the new system delivers convenience, efficiency and speed without compromising security and has enhanced security and transparency overall. With this new innovation, investors no longer need to physically visit central bank's head or branch offices to undergo the manual process of opening CSD accounts, which previously took 14 days and involved laborious manual transactions. Kenyans living in the diaspora are among the anticipated beneficiaries of the DAO CSD platform as it has the capability of limiting fraud in diaspora remittances. The head of state has meanwhile urged Kenyans with principal tax debts to take advantage of the amnesty tax program offer that is running from 1st September 2023 to 30th June 2024. The Finance Act 2023 introduces the tax amnesty to ease the burdens on taxpayers who have accrued interest and penalties on their tax debt and enhance compliance. Uh, it shall serve as a reminder. Reporting for TV News Watch, I'm Gloria Musimbi. Help you in executing.